Hey everyone, up for sale we have a 1987 Volkswagen Vanagon. This is a Westphalia Synchro Edition. Uh, this is a very rare vehicle. It's been in our family uh, since 1987. This is a one owner vehicle. Uh, it was purchased brand new from a dealership in Anchorage, Alaska. And uh, it's been very well kept. And this van also comes with service records. Uh, for everything that has been done on the vehicle uh, since the very beginning. So as you can see, it is very clean all the way around. Uh, the van is in really great shape. Um, you know, overall, uh, just a really, really great van. There is uh, a couple little things just to know about. We're gonna get up close on those so you can see. But uh, as you can see, there's just a few little areas where just a little bit of rust forming. Uh, like around the the windows but it's really nothing major at all uh, anybody that wants to you know drive this van and enjoy it wouldn't wouldn't have to fix that but uh, I assume you know somebody may want to uh, down here you got just a little bit of rust down that crease starting to form look up underneath it's actually really nice underneath uh, I looked at it there's no there's no major rust of any kind really on the other on the bottom side I mean there's small amounts but it's not anything that's uh, even coming close to uh, messing with the structural feel of the vehicle and uh, as you can see it's got the pop top camper which is really nice when you go camping and uh, sleeps four people very comfortably looking down here right behind the bumper just wanted to kind of note this there's a little bit of rust forming on the the crease right there which is uh, which could be addressed <laughs> for the next next person or or not. It's been like that for for a while. It doesn't seem to really uh, Be spreading or anything like that very quickly uh, This car has been been up in the Northwest for quite some time and uh, Just looking closer you can see you know the tires uh, Tires are in good condition got good tread and everything on the tires um, all of them are, are set up like that and uh, And also to uh, reference the pictures there's one hubcap uh, that should be replaced. If, if you see the, uh, the pictures and there's four hubcaps, you'll know that we got the fourth one. Uh, one of them was, was missing, but it should, we should have it by the time this goes up uh, for sale. But uh, yeah, as you can see, just a really, really great van. It's the, the Synchro and uh, we'll go in and check it out. So a couple just to show you too on this, this is the, the passenger side. As you can see, there was there was a little bit, there was a, a very mild uh, incident with this vehicle a while back and you can see a little bit of the, the color matched off just, just barely on that, but it looks really good. And you look right here, you can see on the uh, edge of the window there on the passenger door, just a little bit of that rust where it looks like some water had, had kind of got trapped there. Same with the, the back window, but that's pretty much it. There really isn't... A whole lot of rust on this car at all I mean it is it is in really good shape now we'll go and look on the inside we're gonna take a look in here and uh, as you can see the interior is in amazing shape this is the original upholstery and uh, you know it is just just really really great shape there's no no cuts or scratches or anything like that I mean it really is pretty pristine um, for being that it's you know th over 30 years old I mean it's it does, it's not worn out it's got it's really really good condition uh, you can see over here you know it's the same there's really no no cuts or scrapes or anything like that this is the half camper edition so it's got a really nice table that you can pull out uh, you can check the pictures for that it's got a, a little portable refrigerator uh, that you know plugs into a little area over there and looking down the middle you can see even the carpet is in really great shape these uh these armrests on the inside of each of each ch captain's chair um they just they like fold it down i'm not sure what you'd need to do to repair that but um you know it's been been like that for a while that's really the only issue with anything in the uh in the interior of this so you look down you can see just immaculate condition i mean really amazing for the 1987 van has held up this well and look at even the carpet 
I mean, the carpet is just in really great condition. I mean, this is all original. Everything is original. And uh, the great thing about this car is it was uh, it was driven by by my parents, and they do not drive vehicles hard at all. So this only has 110,000 miles on it, and uh, it runs great. I mean, this is really nice running van. Uh, like I said, it's got you know it's been maintained since since the very beginning back in 1987 and you'll get that you'll get a stack of service receipts uh, you know uh, probably about 500 pages of you know service records oil changes things like that and uh, look in the back here you can see even the back is really great um, this right here fold or, I'm sorry the seat here folds down and uh, this become, it becomes a bed I'll show you that here in a minute as well and uh, you got you know got the cabinet space and everything, so you got plenty of plenty of room for storage in there as well. There's even these uh, these Westphalias even have a little little cubby up here, which is which is very useful for uh, putting things up when you're camping. And there's actually a screen that comes with this that uh, goes over this back. So if you're back here sleeping, you can put the screen up, and uh, it was an, an additional accessory. Uh, that we bought that you know keeps the mosquitoes out if you want to have the back door open while you're sleeping and then up here this is a really really fun area so this is the you know it's got the pop top so this top obviously pops up if you're looking at this van i'm pretty certain you know how this works and uh as you can see the the actual condition of this is is really amazing i mean this is uh barely been used uh this was actually slept up uh, me and my brother had, had slept here maybe five times since we had this thing. So if you look at the uh, Just the condition of the material. I mean this does not absolutely does not need to be replaced. This is in Just great shape. I mean it looks just about new uh, All the material all the way around and then if you're familiar with these this uh, this zips open So you can zip this back and uh, you can look right outside, see the wilderness right from the right from the area where you sleep. So this is a really cool feature. It's a really great, great place to sleep. If you got uh, kids or groups or anything like that, just a really awesome, really awesome uh, camping situation. So, so you got your four seats there. And now with this one, I'm going to go ahead and pull this out. All right, so I got this pulled out so you can see down here this is just a full-size bed as well so this sleeps two people very comfortably and then like i said in the back there uh, there's a mosquito net that can go in there as well and uh but overall as you can see there's no there's no cracks in the dash or anything like that um you know if you're if you're interested in one of these vans and you're looking for the synchro i know the synchros are very popular uh you know vans as far as that goes and they're they're extreme, extremely rare, uh, especially in this condition. And like I said, it's even got the the uh, Farfig Nugent uh, sticker, which was a big promotional bit back then in the 80s. And uh, looking inside here, you can see there's 110,000 miles on this car. So uh, only 110,000. This has got to be one of the lowest, well well maintained uh, Volkswagen Vanagon Synchros uh, that I've ever seen from 1987. In 1987 was also the first year that they did what they called the weekender or the half camper uh, which comes with the refrigerator and the table and everything as well so very, very well kept someone's really gonna enjoy this um, and this is is for sale uh, you can you can ask any questions that you have about the vehicle and uh, you can also put in your offers and we'll be happy to get back to you good luck everyone